have the Tennessee Titans plus two and a half. You have the Patriots team total under 17 and a half. You have Indianapolis here getting a point. As we're taping right now. You get one book has a point, man. And so exactly we'll take right. a point for the Colts. Let's get to your, your best bet of the week, Bear. What do you got? Uh, I'm betting against the Buccaneers here. Uh, as, as I did on Monday night, I'm going to play the, I, I, Jameis. Fine, I'll ride with Jameis. I'll lay three points with the Saints. Uh, the Saints defense a lot this year is a lot. What 15, 17, and 18 yeah, points. They're good on defense. Yeah, they're really good on defense. We saw that Bucks offense is very limited. I mean, they're not facing an Eagles type defensive line, but I think they're going to have trouble moving the ball if they, if they can. If they can get to twenty points, this field. If they can get to twenty <laughs> points, fine. But uh, I do like the Saints coming off of yeah. the, blowing that game last week. Uh, coming home, I'll lay the three with New Orleans. We nailed that Bucks Eagles game last weekend. We were all yeah. on that. Yeah, nothing. It, was, nothing, it made no sense. It didn't make sense. Yeah. The number, and fortunately, it was one of those instances where the number that didn't make sense. Yeah. We were on the right side of why it didn't make sense. We absolutely were. My best bet for the week is fading Zach Wilson. Let's go Jets under fifteen and a half points. They're hosting the Chiefs this weekend. The Chiefs defense has allowed fourteen points, nine points, and ten points. They're really good defense. They're, 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 they're uh, fifth in efficiency right now. And more than anything else, Bear, you're a Jets fan. You unfortunately have to watch all of these games. Zach Wilson is playing with no confidence whatsoever. Like none. Like zero. <laughs> I, unless they score defensively, How they're just score? not going to score twice on offense. It's just not going to happen, right? Like they're not going to be able to move the ball down the field. There's whispers about sort of this revolt coming at some point by the Jets' defense, right, because Zach Wilson's not able to help them out at all. Trevor Simeon's not going to play, but even if he did, I don't feel great about it. So to me, you look at what Zach Wilson is right now, you look at the Chiefs' defense, and you just say, you know what, let's fade the Jets scoring two touchdowns, basically. And so I'm going Jets under here, 15 and a half. Uh, this might be Zach Wilson's last game under, under center, which it probably should be. He's not a good quarterback. He's not set but up for they this. Don't, but they don't, you hit on it before. They don't have a plan. Like you're not, you're really signing Trevor Simeon just to play Trevor Simeon. Yeah, they, like they had no plan. And in this game, Kansas City's defense guys, they played five rookies last season for a big majority of a Super Bowl championship defense. They're, they're <laughs> really good this year. They're going to blitz. We know Steve Spagnuolo loves to blitz. They're going to just, he's going to be bad for Zach Wilson. And everything's I, bad. And, and like he just doesn't even complete basic routes. And there was a video I saw put out where he just hit a check down when he had Wilson open. He's not a confident player right now. Chiefs are playing with confidence and they're playing for Taylor Swift. Who's in the crowd uh, for the, for, for the second straight week. So uh, that's my uh, best bet. Bears best bet. Obviously, as we talked about in new Orleans here, minus the three. Bear Bets full episodes drop twice a week right here on the Bear Bets YouTube channel. Remember to subscribe to stay ahead of the odds and let's celebrate all of our wins together.